Those people of Biafra on Saturday accused the Mieti Hala bodies of collaborating with security agencies to force vigilante groups across the southeast to hand over their weapons. IPOB alleged that the aim of the collaboration is to weaken the southeast and pave the way for Fulani bandit invasion of the region. Imar Parafo, the spokesman of IPOP, made the claim in a statement where he raised an alarm over influx of hunters into the southeast. According to Imar Parafo, we the global movement and the family of the indigenous people of Biafra, IPOP, heavily led by our great leader, Liberator Marzi Namdekano have uncovered a secret meeting Mieti Hala had with the hierarchy of various security agencies to disarm vigilante groups in Biafra land. They agreed at the meeting that all vigilante groups in Biafra land would be directed to surrender their weapons to security agencies. Their intention is to weaken our people and pave the way for the invasion of our communities by Fulani bandits masquerading as herdsmen. We want to place the word on notice about this wicked plot. We also raise an alarm over the influx of Fulani rapists and terrorists called Fulani hunters in our land. Our people must be careful because Fulani and Mieti Hala have devised another means of killing our people in the bushes and forest in Biafra land. The recent plan by the Nigerian government and its security agencies to collect guns from vigilante groups in every community in Biafra land was designed to make our security and vigilante men important and clear the way for the criminal gangs to penetrate our communities. We, therefore, urge vigilante groups in various communities never to surrender their weapons to security agencies that cannot guarantee the security of our people. Doing so amounts to rendering our communities vulnerable. We also want to caution all communities in Biafra land to be on red alert over the plots by the enemies of Biafra to see their agents of death to inflict pain and sorrow on our people. Security should be beefed up around all Biafra communities because our enemies are not sleeping, the statement read. <laughs> Meanwhile, Nigerians have reacted. Ima, I always enjoy your opinions, but I don't think your opinion here is right because feminization agenda has been a thing of the past. Their plan did not work as planned. You don't understand, bro. Who made their plans not to work in the in the past, as he said? Receive thanks, so my brother. But Imapov is saying the truth. Some vigilantes have submitted their guns, and our leaders are keeping quiet. I think IPOB is very correct in this particular case, because that was what happened in Benue and Plateau State. Immediately, Buhari came to power, and the next thing was the mass killings that happened within the two states. What is the function of ESN? Have they finally weakened the security apparatus of the IPOP stroke ESN? Good question, someone just dropped that. The Southeast Security Network stop attacking Nigerian security, but protect your region against any bandits or Fulani militants because it is your constitutional right to defend yourself. Okay, can you differentiate between Fulani militant and Nigerian security? Re militants operate in the house sketch and not in the town. So militants don't have barracks and divisions in the town. Hence, use your head because I do not know why you are saying what you don't know. Okay, the comments are getting tougher. You guys are very stupid though. Whoa. Have you held, have you handed over your weapons you have been using to kill and slaughter people's throats like killing goats? 
you are talking nonsense okay someone just dropped that agenda helps no one stop killing your own people the only place to live is in russia exactly their plans but that they have failed never allow the devil close to an inch before you don't try such nonsense because we nothing we can do in common with all this rubbish element okay nigerians are still talking they must be mad this northern idiot always acts like they own this country and everything must favor them see that one when one claim royalty on another man airline when not be your private jet i don't understand how this set of people mix up with right thinking people <laughs> okay guys these are some reactions by nigerians the indigenous people of Biafra, IPOP, on Saturday accused the Mieti Hala bodies of collaborating with security agencies to force vigilante groups across the southeast to hand over their weapon. IPOP alleged that the aim of the collaboration is to weaken the southeast and pave the way for Fulani bandit invasion of the region. Imapa, for the spokesman of IPOP, made the claim in a statement where he raised an alarm over inflock hunters into the southeast. According to Powerful, we, the global movement and the family of the indigenous people of Biafra, Ipo, heavily led by our great liberator, Marzi Inam de Kano, have uncovered a secret meeting, Mieti Hala, held with the hierarchy of various security agencies to dismay, to disarm vigilante groups in Biafra land. They agreed at the meeting that all vigilante groups in Biafra land would be directed to surrender their weapons to security agencies. He said their intention is to weaken the people and pave the way for the invasion of their communities by Fulani bandits masquerading as herdsmen. According to Ima Powerful, we want to place the world on notice about this wicked plot. So guys, if you've heard it now, kindly share your thoughts with us below the comment section. Thank you very much.